Welcome back to Revelation Banjo. Uh, we wanted to share with you some of the techniques that are used on that song, Sun Island. So for you banjo players or musicians out there, uh, these, are, these are some of the things that are going on in that song. So the introduction has uh, double stops, you know, hitting two strings at once, like on a G chord here, followed up by a hammer-on, and then same thing on a C chord, a double stop with a pull-off, and then an A minor with a hammer-on. The other thing that's going on there is some, a little rhythmic piece that is um, a, I'm putting a, the palm on the bridge of the banjo and just striking like this to provide rhythm. going on is, let's see, well actually that, that continues as the song goes on, uh, it, I just play it softer and a, a little bit more with the, with the palm on the bridge to leave room for the vocal. There's an island in the deep blue sea with pure white. It makes it a little more percussive in the background. On the solo, basically it's arpeggios and double stops. And then on that C chord, it's actually a C9 chord. Open, open strings. Open strings are your friend. They really add a lot of uh, depth. And then after I play the C9, uh, we take off the third finger to make it basically a major nine. So... combination of um, eighth note strumming with your right hand and uh, putting pressure on and taking pressure off with your left hand. If you leave pressure on it sounds like this. If you add, you know, take away pressure, you get the, you get the rhythm there. Performance gets uh, louder and more, you know, spirit spirited, and that's done with a little more volume in the playing. You know, you know, that's coming from the volume mostly, um, and the vocal performance. Everything's just coming up, you know, more engaged, and then something that happens at the very end. On the what I'm doing there, eighth notes on the bottom string. Harmonic. 